Hi friends! Today is gonna be a video of all of my signed editions. There are a lot of videos out there where people talk about their signed editions and like they'll tell you stories of getting their book signed and yada yada blada yada blada. I have personally never been to a book signing mostly due in part to I live in rural Ohio which means not a lot going on around here. There was one for Cassie Clare a couple of years ago about two hours from me and I was going to go but it ended up being on like the day that I had something else going on and I couldn't not be at work so like that's the most recent one. I think the one prior to that was like six or seven years ago. Now my local bookstore has been doing really good about getting in authors to sign books so I may have more opportunity for that in the future but so far um, it's not been anybody that I was like super interested in going but I may in the future just go to them for to, to be there and to go. Recently not really been to anything, never been to a book signing ever. Um, so this is more of like a what can you get signed without actually going to a book signing. Okay? Because I know some of you would like to have signed books and you don't live in California or New York or Florida, which can make it difficult. So this first stock of books is all Alcrate books. Um, I have been a subscriber to Alcrate for I'd say about a year. I think I subscribed last year when um, Where Dreams Descend by Janelle Angelis was coming out because um, I really wanted that edition specifically and I really wanted to read that book didn't end up loving it but that is outside of the point so I do have about a year's worth from there uh so the first is Horrid by Katrina Leno this is a special edition cover it's actually they're all special edition covers but like this is the inside of the dust jacket because I hated the cover um and this one particularly has a tippin page that is signed we then have The Gilded Ones by Nomina Forma, signed, Legend Born by Tracy Dion, Lore by Alexander Bracken, Where Dreams Descend by Janelle Angelis, The Ones Were Meant to Find by Joan He, Star Daughter by Shweta Takrar. Goddess in the Machine by Laura Beth Johnson, which is Steeped in Gold by Shannon Smart. It's probably a little harder to see because it's in this weird goldy comfort color. Sweet and Bitter Magic by Adrian Tooley. And This Poison Heart by Kaylin Braylon. So our next grouping of signed books are books that I pre-ordered. Now I think I've separated these out, maybe a little off, but I think I've separated them out to um, books that I've pre-ordered and were just like a basic signature and books that I pre-ordered that have like a special signature. A lot of authors, especially because of the Panini, are going and working with their local indie bookstore and having some sort of like a pre-order campaign where if you pre-order the book, they'll go and sign the book and it will be delivered to you around release date not necessarily on release date because a lot of these again are like local indie bookstores so that's where I have a lot of these from I'm not going to show you the signature in all of these because it's the same signature in all of them but I have my Witchland series are all signed I showed these in a previous video as well um where I showed my collection of Witchlands books but um like these are all signed by Suze there we go and of those I have like the whole series Blood Witch Wind Witch, not in any sort of order. Truth Witch, Blood Witch again, and Witch Shadow. So the first four were signed when they released the new covers and they were like a pre-order of the new covers from Schuler Books which is Suze's local indie and so those were all regular signed and then this was ordered through Beacon Book Box I believe and it was just regular signed. As I showed in the previous video, I also have this like special signed one that I got from Schuler Books. Um, 
that Sue signed for me that says, uh, thank you for all your support. Remember the moon shines too. Um, at this point, Sue's knew who I was when she signed my book because uh, I had commented on something on Instagram and she was like, awesome, I just signed your book too this weekend. So, uh, yay. Uh, <laughs> so this one's a special one. This is my baby. Anyway, moving on. Uh, back to just like regular pre-order signs. Um, Cemetery Boys by Eden Thomas has a signed book plate, which is just a sticker basically that they put in these. Um, you get the book on usually on release date and then um, the publisher will like mail you the sticker that's been signed after the fact. Um, this is Bud Like Magic by Lizelle Sanbury and this was a special release from Emboss and Stein, which has sprayed edges and also came with a signed book plate as well. If you don't know, Lizelle is a fellow author too, so I will link her channel in the description box down below if you'd like to know more about this book and her writing process of it. This is an interesting one. This is Lady Midnight by Cassandra Clare and this one is actually a stamp signature. Um, the signature itself is part of the stamp and then there's just like a design that's a stamp. So this one was actually signed, it was stamped. This one is one of my favorites. It is House of Hollow by Crystal Sutherland and the signature is actually, um, it's a book plate but it's see-through and it has like the floral design on it. Super cute, love that one. And then also a book plate for a pre-order was The Project by Courtney Summers. I think these are some more that actually have like kind of a story behind them or are like a more fancy style of signature. This one is The Ruby Circle by Rochelle Mead. This was the final book in our Bloodline series so it has got a long signature in it that says the finale is here and hashtag epic. Um, the next two are Twisted Fate and Twisted Gift. These are by another author tuber, Jesse Elliott, who I will link in the description box down below. So these have my name and then like a little saying and then Jesse's signature and both of those and those were pre-orders that came directly from Jesse. Um, How the King of Elf came, Learn to Hate Stories and this was a pre-order from I believe Barnes and Noble and it's got a tip in page that's signed. I'm out of space to stack books. Capturing the Devil by Carrie Mariscalco signed. That was a pre-order. Oh, this is an interesting one. This one I actually bought secondhand at a like surplus bookstore that shall not be named. And it is Will Always Have Summer by Jenny Hahn. It is signed. I didn't know it was signed when I bought it. It does not match my other covers and I used to hate that it didn't match my other covers. Um, but this one's signed so it's special. So it doesn't matter. And then this beast Queen of Air and Darkness by Cassie Clare. This one's actually signed. It does not a stamp like Lady Midnight. Uh, Chain of Iron, which is also signed. Cassie Clare, etc, etc. I've talked about this one recently on my channel. This is It Ends With Us by Colleen Hoover. I won this one forever ago on Colleen's Facebook page uh, when it came out, which was 2016. This was one was one of the ones that I've actually owned since before Booktube and Colleen signed it and sent it to me and I keep dropping the bookmark out of it. And then the final signed book that I have is Fable by Adrian Young and it is signed to me with Adrian's signature. So those are all of my signed editions. Again, that's a lot of them and I, I really wanted to show you guys that even though if you live somewhere that you can't get to a book signing, it is possible to get signed books. A lot of authors will run pre-order campaigns um, and you'll either get like a signed copy of the book or a book plate or um, something of that sort that you can add in. Um, they really vary across the board. Um, some authors will do international, some will not. It really depends on the publisher and what the publisher is willing to do. A lot of that doesn't have much to do with the author themselves. Um, so definitely if you are interested in getting a book signed by an author that you love, look into, um, a lot of them will either talk about it on like their Twitter or on their Instagram or on their author page. Um, I know like Susan Dennard, you can order any of her previous books from Schuler Books and get those signed. I know Adrienne Young, if she's doing a new release for a book, you can also order one of her previous releases and get it signed. Um, so some of them will do that. Some do like all the time and some will do only when they're releasing the next book. Um, but you 
you can also get signed books of books that have been previously released as well depending on the author. That is all I have for today. I post reading, writing, book, and planner related videos a couple of times a week. If you don't want to miss anything I have in the future make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell down below and until then I will see you guys next time. Bye!